Hello guys and welcome to my channel. This is Alex and in today's tutorial I would like to teach you how you can fix the Windows search problem so you cannot start typing into the search bar inside of Windows here. And also the language bar disappeared. So I had a problem when I fixed all of this and when I restarted my PC everything restarted to normal and that means that I couldn't type anything and that the language bar disappeared every time I restarted my PC and this is the fix. So basically what you're gonna do is you copy this, you click Windows plus R on your keyboard or you create a new notepad document and write run on it and then you copy it and then inside the search bar because you cannot type anything you just paste the text. I know how you feel guys and I know how problematic this is and you basically copy uh, this here. I will leave it down in the description. And I'm gonna click OK. And after that, immediately the language bar appeared like that. And what about the search? Can I type anything? No, I can't. But how do I fix it? Uh, task Manager, right click on your taskbar and then go to Task Manager. Or you click Control Shift plus Escape on your keyboard and then find Windows Explorer and then right click on it and click on restart. For 10% of you guys this might work and as you can see it worked for me. But when I restart my PC for some reason the language bar for changing the language on my keyboard settings also disappears and the settings for this also disappear. So after I show you how to fix the keyboard uh, for some of you guys which I'm sure this method will work but for me it didn't so Let's do it. Open your task open your task manager again by clicking Control Shift plus Escape and then go to service, then go to file, run your task, and then you type PowerShell. And make sure that you create this task with administrative privileges. And then click on OK. I made a typing mistake. And this should open. Then you just paste it and run it and your language bar should appear and everything should work. So guys this is the method which helped me. So I'm gonna have it by the side here and then I'm gonna have a notepad document with control panel so that I can paste it here and open it as fast as possible. Then what I'm gonna do is gonna do administ admin tools and then I'm gonna find services. I'm gonna open it and then I'm gonna touch keyboard and handwriting panel. Here it is. Then you right click on it, go to properties, startup type. Make sure it's on automatic and then you go to apply, click OK. And what you can also do is you click on start and that's it properties it's set to manual make sure it's an automatic and yeah it's running it's set to automatic and it will be always on automatic double check it first you start it and then you set to automatic or you will have the fate like i had just a few moments ago and I didn't save it correctly. So I'm gonna exit it and when I restart my PC each time the language bar will also appear and also I will type again. But for some of you guys if this didn't work I have another method. So open your uh, task manager again by clicking Control Shift plus Escape and you have to find Cortana. This is the search here, the search helper here for Windows 10 you type Cortana, that's the little blue circle, you find Cortana, let's say this is Cortana, and then you go and end the task, just like that, and that's basically it. Also I have this method, open your uh, Windows Explorer, then go to quick access, then go to right click on it and options, then go to search and make sure you check all the search file names and contents, and then you hit on apply. And always, if you have some problems, don't forget 
to restart your Windows Explorer. So right click and restart. So let's see if it works. And basically that's it for this tutorial guys. If you liked it, please don't forget to share and subscribe. And if you find another solution, please leave it down in the comment section so that other guys can benefit from it and can actually uh, fix their errors which they have on their PC. So thanks for watching, see you the next time.